This creek in eastern Arizona is called the Campbell Blue. The first one is, I think, right back there. One, two, three, four. In mid-August, Arizona Game and Fish biologists Jennifer Pressler and Holly Hicks were here trying to catch an endangered species. We are hoping to catch New Mexico jumping mice tonight. So we've got Sherman traps here that I'm going to be setting along the stream. So I am checking the treadle of my trap, making sure that it is set properly. That way that the mouse will be able to come in and set that trap off. So that's working very nicely. And now we'll set that back down in here in the vegetation. The New Mexico jumping mouse lives in thick vegetation along the banks of streams. Listed as endangered in 2014, it's only found in parts of New Mexico, Colorado, and the White Mountains of Arizona. Jen will come by and flag it and put some bait in there. Bait is just a simple mixture of steel cut oats and unsalted peanuts. And she should be ready to go. So we should be almost to the end of our traps. Holly and Jennifer are helping Northern Arizona University researchers learn more about this endangered species. And we just set 70 traps trying to catch New Mexico jumping mice. We are trying to collect genetic data to look at the genetic diversity of the mouse up here throughout the White Mountains. If we're lucky, we'll have a handful of traps that have jumping mice in them in the morning. No targeted species. We caught three paramiscus, three deer mice this morning. We will close the traps for the day um, and then we will come back and reset everything this evening and we'll check again tomorrow morning and hopefully have better luck on day two. On the second morning, six traps were triggered. This is a paramiscus, a little boy. There were several deer mice. <laughs> His whiskers are really cute though. Wood rats were the catch of the day. We came out to the Campbell Blue this week hoping to capture some jumping mice to collect some DNA. Unfortunately, we weren't able to get the sample that we needed this week. Um, we will likely have to try to come back maybe next year since we're getting so close to hibernation time. I don't know if we'll have a chance again to be out here this year, but we'll be out here again next year to try to collect that sample. We need to finish that puzzle, so eventually we'll get this piece. <laughs>